बिजनेस इनसाइडर इंडिया प्रेजेंट्स होल्ड और इज इट होटल अरे कैसे बोलते हैं यार इसको ग्राफिक लगाओ Elon Musk can't see it. Jack Dorsey jokes about it, but very few can ignore Web3, the next generation of the internet being built on the blockchain. Unlike Web2, Web3 would be decentralized, which means it won't be ruled by big tech. You don't need permissions, censorship is democratic, and your data won't be abused. Sounds pretty good, right? But don't celebrate too soon. Web3 might end up being not as fast or as efficient as Web2 because of its decentralization. And on top of that, humans kind of hate change. Web2 is much easier to use. Meanwhile, blockchain aided Web3 would need a normal person to have technological expertise and software in order to participate. So though it's democratic as a concept, only a few elites may end up enjoying it. And like in most democracies, it could lead to fights and extend conflicts due to the lack of authority. It's also less accessible due to lower integration between web browsers. But that isn't to say that Web3 doesn't have its benefits. For one, it can't be taken down easily by malicious forces. And without permissions, nobody can prevent usage, and even payments don't require personal data since most of it is done using cryptocurrencies. All in all, Web3 may not take over Web2 completely, but it offers another solid and top-end options for those who are tired of Web2 and its pitfalls. That's it for today. Let's meet on another episode of Bolt. Or is it hot? I still don't know. Are graphic lagao yaar.